Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you the best tuck outfits and the best tuck spots on all three ship types. So for clothing for tucking, you want to go no hat, and you want to get a bunch of dark, uh, if you don't have the stuff that I recommend, you want to get the darkest thing you have. The Majestic Southern shirt, sturdy gloves, no jacket, no dress, no belt, sea dog trousers, hunter boots, and then for vanity, no beard, any hair type, actually you can go, you can go any beard you want, or any hair type you want, just make sure you dye your, dye it black. And then the hunter eye patch, no hook or peg leg. And then you don't want to do any curses. And that's it for the outfit. And this is what you'll look like if you have those. Also, guys, if you want to have makeup on your face to blend in better, I recommend you have Stripe, Brave, or Sawtooth. Now, when you're tucking, if the other player's ship has their lanterns on, you want to turn all the lanterns off near the spot that you're going to be tucking. So if you're going to be tucking down here, you want to turn off these two lanterns right here. And if you're going to be tucking down here, you want to turn off these lanterns. It'll help you blend in more, and the other player will not be able to see you as much. Alright, the first hiding spot on the sloop is going to be right here on this little ledge over here. I recommend you get the um you get the uh hiding emotes because the sleeping emote is not as good as the hiding emote. And this is probably the best spot on the sloop to hide. Spot two is right here next to the cannon. Now to get here in this area, I recommend you move the cannon left to right and you want to go on the side Opposite of the where they're pointing, and you want to do the hide emote. You can adjust it any way you want to to bond in better. And that is the second spot. All right, the third spot on the sloop is going to be right here behind the uh, map table. This isn't the best spot to hide, but if you're in a hurry, this is a this is a decent spot to hide. So the last spot on the sloop is going to be right here next to the barrels and the brig. And again, this isn't the best spot, but if you're in a hurry, this is a good spot to hide. Alright, so now for the brigantine. Again, just like the sloop, if you aim the cannon to the left or right, and you hide it right here. And then you can adjust how you want it. You can hide really well. A classic spot for the brigantine is right here behind the voyage table. And you want to have these uh this hatch open so you can see what the crew's doing. And they're not going to look back here that often. And it's a really good spot to see what they're doing and allows you to know the time to strike. The third spot for the brigantine is going to be right here next to the map table, right next to these barrels. And you can see the map really easily from here. And if you have a, another crewmate on your ship while you're tucking, you can let them know where where the enemy ship is at and what they're doing so you know when to strike. So the last spot on the brigantine, and I just recently learned this, it's actually up here on the, on the mast. And it's not on the main mast. I recommend, well, you can go on either mast. But I'm going to show you the best spots. So you can, I recommend doing the uh, deck hide emote on this. But whichever one looks better to you, you can do. And then, you can. I, rec I don't recommend hiding right here, because they're going to see when they come up the ladder. So what you want to do is you want to either hide here. Or get over here and hide. Or what you can do also is get over here. And you can hide right here. Right next to this. And like I said you can do the deck hide. 
or the normal hide. But this is very hard to see. And this is probably the best spot on the Brigantine. Alright, so now for the Galleon. Again, just like the sloop and the Brigantine, right here next to the cannon is a good hiding spot. And probably the best hiding spot on the Galleon is going to be right here. If I can get there. It's kind of hard to get to. But once you get here, I recommend deck hide. Because uh, that'll hide you the most. If you want to do normal hide, that's fine. It'll still hide you. Actually, I think hide is probably better than deck hide, but whichever one you want to use, that's fine. So this is probably the best spot to hide in the galleon. For the third spot on the galleon, is going to be right here behind the captain's quarters chair. And they usually don't look back here, so this is going to be a really good hiding spot. Alright, for the fourth spot on the galleon, you can hide right here, but you can also hide right here, and you can also hide right here, and right here. For the fifth spot on the galleon, it's right where we left off last time. Just come up here, and go over here, and you can do deck hide, or you can do normal hide. and these little things on the side of the boat there is I think about three on each side so whatever side you want to do it on you can do it on that side that you want alright for the sixth spot on the galleon it's also a really good hiding spot it's right in front of the steering wheel and to look up and down you can just zoom in and out and on controller uh, it's left trigger and right trigger I'm not sure what it is on computer though. But this is a really good spot and when you want to strike this is a really good spot to strike from. And the last spot to hide on the galleon is basically the very bottom. You can hide you can hide right here. You can hide anywhere. Just by any of these barrels. Right here. And with all the other spots in the boat, they're not going to find you down here. 